942, August, I think. What day is it, August? <laughs> Let me do that again. 12. Oh, okay, thanks. Alright, we're gonna go to the gym already. We're doing a long leg day today. Black cat fist bump. Fist bump. Alright, good enough. <laughs> All right, so we just finished our leg workout. Ken, David's brother Ken, first time I think on the camera. David. Huh? Oh yeah. And Yasue. Yasue got tired, man. She did she did some real workouts and she was like, she was like, I'm gone. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel now? How do you feel now? I'm tired. Tired? Yeah, so we're all gonna go to a Vietnamese restaurant together. Get some pho. Except Yasuo who can't eat fudge, like allergic or something. And uh, Ken's gonna, he's gonna ride his bike there, man. Right. Holy moly. So, as you saw, I hit my goal. Ooh. As you saw, I hit my goal. I was supposed to get at least, or you didn't know it was my goal, but I was supposed to get at least eight reps of 100 kilos and max 10 reps. So, no more than 10, but no less than eight. So, I, I was able to get. I think I got all 10 reps of the 100 ki kilos and then I was supposed to do some sets of three and I did them afterwards. So overall very productive day, but I had one messed up set where I was supposed to do um, I was supposed to do a set of three of 102.5 kilos, but they don't have 1.25 plates so I just did, I was just trying to do 105 kilos and uh, so I put it on right and I unracked the weight and I was like man like I, I must have grabbed the bar uneven or put it uneven on my back because it was a little leaning on my right side. I was like, ah, shit. And then I, I just re I, un I put it back, unracked it again, and I was like, all right, whatever, F it, you know? So I did my set of three, I finished, and then when we were taking off the plates for uh, the next person to go, I can't remember, I think, Ken? Yeah, when we were taking the weights off, I realized I had put a 20 and a 15 instead of a 15 and a 15. So I was doing 40. 2.5 on the left side and 47.5 on the right side. <laughs> <laughs> so we're over here at Fuhua, Fuhua. and we, we bought some uh, Vietnamese, some classic Vietnamese food. <laughs> we'll show you what we got when it hits the table. Look at this, can you see the steam? I can see the steam. Steaming. Yasue and David both got like a soup that comes with their meal. She said it's consomme flavor. When I asked what, what's consomme anyways? Because that's like a popular thing in Japan. Consomme. Chicken. Oh. Like chicken bouillon. Oh. Oh, what? Consomme is just chicken bouillon. Interesting. I did not know that. What is that? She got like a... Looks like a barbecued chicken rice, but what is this thing? Is it fish? Look at that. Fish? I don't know. What'd you get, David? Shrimp dried rice. Uh, dry noodles. Shrimp dried noodles? That looks good. Look at that. Get a zoom in on that. Oh, yeah, boys and girls. What'd you get, Ken? Fish noodle. <laughs> All right. And it's like a sweet and sour, hot and sour. Fish noodle soup. Look at that. That's what it smells like, anyways. That's good. Where's mine? <laughs> All right, what is Yasu is gonna try her mystery patty? What is it? Here we go. Kiss me. What is it? It's good. No idea. 
No idea. <laughs> Alright, well here's mine. Check this out. Oh shiz. Look at that steak bowl. A steak full. Mmm. That looks delicious. Oh, let me give you a pan over it. Get a zoom over. Ooh. Steak bowl. Oh yeah. And what do we got here? Caterino just sitting over here chilling in the chair making it to where no one can take it so uh yeah so and I just did some laundry did some laundry took a little nap because we're or I took a nap she took, like, she took a short nap I took a nap did our laundry it's all hung up and ready to go and we're about to go run these streets of Taipei because uh, this is not like an actual meal or anything but we're gonna go and we're gonna find one of the most well, it's pretty much the most famous bakery in Taipei. Originally, it started in Kaohsiung, but they made a new one in Taipei Black Cat. <laughs> so we're gonna go find it, and uh, hopefully, we can buy some of the uh, world. They have one of the one of the breads. It's called like red wine longan bread, and it actually won the uh, French like bread. Comp I don't know, French bread competition beating every other bread. So we're going to try to buy some of that. But, um, you know, we don't have Wi-Fi. We only have an image of what we saw and an idea. So hopefully we don't get lost. Alright, we're out of paddle. Check it out. What are we doing right now, Yasu? What are we doing right now? We are going to uh, lunches. Now we're running these streets. <laughs> Come on. Look at, the, look at the crazy designs on this metro. Anime people everywhere. Whoa. Oh my god, we're on the metro without David. <laughs> Hopefully we don't get lost. Check this out, check this out, check this out. We're using my excellent memorization skills of pictures. I know that it's we're right here and all we do is go up, hit this thing, go right, and it is right freaking here and Yasue can memorize kanji because Chinese characters are also Japanese characters so even if she can't read it in Chinese she knows what it is in Japanese so we're not gonna get lost <laughs> so we're at this department oh we're at this department store and and is it is it oh my god freaking bread store wow holy shiz look at this thing we are here at the famous Wu Pao Chun, I don't even know, bread store, bakery. Wu Pao Chun Bakery. This is cool, man. Holy shit, I'm excited. World famous. Seriously. Look at this rose lover. It's got the hearts on it. That's so freaking cute. Oh my god. European walnut bread, French bacon and cheese bread. Big ass naan. Oh man. So look, this is a bread store. Pretty cool. Got all these nice breads. Everything sounds so good. They like all kinds of bread. Ooh, souvenirs. Oh wow, they have look, they have look, they have souvenirs over here. Yeah, that's the one. Rose we saw lover. rose lover. Yeah, yeah. But look at this. Look at this. They have souvenir yeah, pineapple cakes. Oh, that's pretty oh, crazy. Yeah, so, damn! So we're inside the bread store, I'm about to buy this big ass award-winning bread. That's why it's got all the small ones on her little plate that we're gonna take out. Look at this. And, uh, I'm very excited to try this. Are you excited? Are you excited? Yeah. Wow, they, they even gave us a sample. What is it? Do you know? Walnut? Walnut? Alright, here we go. Mmm! It's like super chewy. What is this? Look at this. What is this? What is this? Mentaiko pan. Mentaiko spicy cod roll bread. Let me get a pic actually. Sorry for the interruption. I had to take some aesthetic as fuck pictures. So now for the live taste test. Here we go. <laughs> Stop hiding. People need to see the live taste test. We gotta see how it crunches. Let's go, come on. 
Oh wait, what? Oh, there's cream in there? Oh shit. Alright, alright, one more, one more. It's so hard. Not good? Yeah, I mean, no. The shell? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. Me? Alright, here we go. Someone couldn't do it right, so here we go, live taste test. Ready? Uh huh. So this is the, uh, from the award winning bread shop. Woo. How chun. We're going with the uh, mentaiko baguette, spicy cod roll baguette. Ready? T live taste test. Wow, big bite. Don't finish my bread. <laughs> See? I told you. Mm. <laughs> Ow! Tastes is really good. Yeah, the taste is really good. You taste the spicy cod roe. Bread actually tastes really good too. I may have taken too big of a bite. It's really hard to break the shell. <laughs> so we were gonna go to a Korean chicken place, but now we're here at this Taiwanese local kind of place. Uh, it's very, very homey. Local Taiwanese, look at this. Oh shit. It looks like a local Taiwanese hangout kind of place. Well, that's pretty, it smells really good in here, so... I don't know, I'm gonna ask David about the name. So this is kind of, kind of like a Taiwanese izakaya. And the uh, check this out. So, so I'm gonna show you everything we get, I'll try. So we got self-service rice over there, which is awesome. And all you do is mark what you want on a piece of paper and give it to them. So right here. Yasui really likes this uh, grass and uh, it's called Kong, Kong Xing Cai. That means empty, empty like hollow middle vegetable as you can see. Hollow in the middle. This is like Yasui's favorite, <laughs> favorite vegetable. I don't know what this is. It looks like fried clams or something like that. It looks pretty good. And, uh, She's trying to get me drunk. This is Yasuo's friend. She's trying to get me drunk. She's trying to get me drunk, but I'm not having it. <laughs> Correction, this is that sticky thing that's stuck to the clam. You know when you pull the clam out, there's always like a little tube? That's what this is. And this is like beef stir fry with more of Yasuo's favorite vegetable in it. <laughs> Alright, check it out. Kung Pao chicken. Real Kung Pao chicken, not that Panda Express Kung Pao chicken. What is this? What's this? Oh, Mapo Tofu! Woo! Love Mapo Tofu. Check this out. Hey David, what's this? So what's inside? Pineapple shrimp. Pineapple shrimp? Oh, baby! That's like a little candy sprinkles on it. One more time? Oh my god. She's saying I have to try this one more time. This is uh, intestines. Alright, this is intestines. Pork. Pork intestines. Alright, fine. I'll eat it one more time. Here's the 
a lobster salad. Got the little candy sprinkles on it, mayonnaise everywhere. There's actually lobster in there. It's pretty good actually. But it's a, why did I say actually so many times? But uh, it's really sweet. It's like almost dessert. Everything's pretty good so far though. Except, except, except. Ugh. Okay, so Sayuri just got here. Not picture. She's to my left over there, and. Uh, so we ordered some. Oh, oh, oh. So we ordered some again, and uh, we got this drunken chicken part two. Yesterday we had drunken chicken at the Xiao Long Bao place. Now we're having drunken chicken here. Looks pretty good. As you can see, that stuff's gone. That stuff's all peanuts. This is almost all peanuts. This is like candy and lobster and wasabi and eggs. Yeah, so too many peanuts, man. Too many freaking peanuts. Oh my god. Which one's beer? Left or right? Comment down below! Oh yeah, that was a pretty good meal, pretty big meal. Is that, is that a real? Real fish. No way. Yeah, real fish. What? Yeah. You can't, you. Wow, it's real. <laughs> is it alive? What? It's not alive. It's not alive. <laughs> How could it be alive? <laughs> What's the name of this place? Uh, let's check. Yeah, it's uh, search that character. <laughs> what? Is, how do you say it? Uh, Xunxing. Xunxing. Xun Xunxing. <laughs> Taiwanese style, izakaya style. Yeah, pretty good. Big meal. All of that food was 1400 New Taiwan dollars, which is about 5,600 yen, which is about $48 US dollars for all that. Not bad at all. Unlimited rice. Pretty good. I like it. I like it. What did you think about this place? It was good. It was good? Good price. She ate like half a bowl of rice. <laughs> yeah. Dun, dun, dun. So we got here the award winning French competition. First place. Red wine and longin bread from Pu Wow. I, I can't remember what. Pu Wow Chan or. Pao Wu Chun. Wu mm. Pao Chun. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, woof. Wu Pao Chun Bakery. We got it right here. We're about to prepare it, taste a little bit of it. And I searched up what a longin was because I, I know what red wine is, obviously, but I was like, what is a longin? And it's a, a tropical fruit indigenous to the South Asia that is in the same family as a lychee. So, if you know what you know, lychee is, Asian fruit. So, we're going to cut this up and prepare it. So, can you camera me? Instructions were to cut it into fourths first. Okay, so they actually give you an instruction page. So we're supposed to cut this into fourths. It's massive. Here we go. Look at this. The beauty. The beauty. All right. So watch, watch and learn. Just kidding. I have no, I have no idea what I'm doing. So I'm gonna cut this into fourths because that's what the instructions. So here, this is not even a bread knife, guys. I, I don't have a bread knife, so. Should I like this? Yeah, sure. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, 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 oh. oh gosh. I wish this was a bread knife. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. All right, part two. Now we're gonna finish it in the fourths. So let me just do, let me just finish it. <laughs> just kidding. All right.
Alright, there we go. Looks good. Smells like a wine. Last piece right here. Cut. Watch me samurai this. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh shit, it comes straight off. Alright, good. So now we're gonna cut this up. So we want it to be smaller so it fits in the tiny convection oven. So, cut some slices. Want to cut some slices? Mm -hmm. Piece for what? <laughs> one, one piece for me. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat this. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Nice. <laughs> one piece for yesterday. Put these on the tray. Warm them up and serve them. It's not going to fit. Should I stack them or no? Mm, no. Just two at a time? Mm. So we'll do these. Me and you first. This is you. Oh, thank you. You have to eat all of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's bigger than I thought. Alright, so here we go. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Bam. Oh. And there we go. Whoops, just kidding, I forgot we have to put some, a little bit of water on the outside. We don't have a spray bottle, so Yasu is just, you know, using her wet, dirty hands. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so we're just going to put some water inside. The instructions said to uh, just spray the outside with a spray bottle, so, you know. I think the point is to just get it wet a little bit so it's not super hard once you cook it. Alright, is that good? That's enough? Alright, yeah, I don't want to Yeah, that's fine. Alright, here we go. Back in the oven. It's almost done. Oh my goodness. Getting excited. But man, whoever used this thing before, like, they left all... A lot of their crumbs fell to the bottom and they, like, didn't clean it up. So it's kind of, like, making smoke smell now. Which is not good. Uh... Alright. Live taste test. Here we go. Alright, here we go. I got the big one. Oh, look at this. Oh, man. Here we go. What? Huh? Give him what? Huh? No. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow, that's hilarious. Wow. One of the one of the cats grabbed a piece and ate it, which is kind of annoying, but you know, whatever. We had a lot. We had a lot anyways. Let him enjoy it. The cat throws up his fall, he stole it. Alright, here we go, ready? Taste test. Whoa. Wow. Wow. That's really good. Holy crap. Wow, I don't... I don't even know how to explain that. That's... Damn. How is it? It's chewy. How does it taste? Mm, hard to explain. We just tasted the red wine, the long bean, the bread, the award winning first place on the bread. And uh, to be honest, I'm going to be very honest with you, I can't even explain what it tastes like to you because it's just such a unique flavor. It's like there's a little bit of sweetness from the long bean, but it's like it's red wine kind of flavor. And there's some walnuts in there as well. It's just a very unique flavor, but I think it tastes good. But I think if you're a very like simple, only simple stuff person, you might not be able to appreciate it. Like if, you, if you're just into eating Pop Tarts and Lucky Charms and chocolate cake, you might not like this because it's got a very strange and like hot, more sophisticated flavor, you know. So I don't know, but I think you should still try it just because 
it's award winning. You know, that's the only reason I'm, I walked into the store, saw the price, pretty expensive. I don't care, I grab it because it's award winning and we gotta try it. You know what I'm saying? What did, what did you think? Okay. Give me your opinions, Yasue. Uh, it's very unique. Very unique. And it's hard to describe. But did you like it? I like it. But what? Oh um, what? It's not like super delicious. Not super delicious? Oh my god. <laughs> hot, hot, fresh out the oven. Uh, David, official, taking a break from his work to get the official ta live taste test. Right. Here we go. Oh, the crunch. Crispy. Yeah. Wow. That's some kind of fruit inside, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got like that lychee, lychee, whatever, family fruit. Another bite, second bite. Bite number two. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm getting to the nuts. He's getting to the nuts, guys. Yeah. <laughs> the almonds, the, I think the they're almonds. walnuts, right? Walnuts? Yeah, I think they're walnuts. Okay. Bite number three. <laughs> 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 so bite number three. <laughs> you want to take all the bites? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. No, no more surprises. Yeah. All right. Nuts and fruits. Nuts yeah. and fruits. Very crispy. Very crispy. So what do you think? Give us a detailed description. Are the cats touching the freaking bag? Hang on. Let's take the bag, let's take the bag. These effing cats. Black cat, I've had enough of you. I've had enough of you today. Freaking black cat, man. Messing with... He took a piece of bread and ate it. Yeah, he took like a, this, this piece of size of bread and ate it. Like he jumped on the counter while I was putting it in the oven and just grabbed it and ate it. Seriously, man. Freaking black cat. All right, he's abusing our friendship. All right, so. This is nothing I had uh, like ever before. And you can kind of taste the, 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 the wine flavor. Uh-huh. Yeah. And I don't know. <laughs> Do you like it? It's, it's good. It's good? It's good. <laughs> All right, there we go. So everyone said it's good. I think it tastes pretty damn good. What would you say? Kind of good, good, or very good, or whatever? Good. Okay. Good. Yeah, good. And Yasuo said it was good, but not delicious. This. <laughs> wrestling. Look at the wrestling. Wrestling cats. Dude, black cat, man, this guy's been going crazy today. Taking our bread, throwing shit off the table, fighting other cats. Oh wow, the punch to the face. Oh, look at him, he's, he's threatening him. Wow, what the heck, look at that, that's so interesting. Look at this, guys. Do it again, Black Hat. Oh, he said, nope, I'm walking away. I don't need, I got the camera on me, I can't do it anymore. And this cat's like, what the hell just happened? <laughs> Black Hat, man, a little troublemaker. Eating people's shoes? Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at the steam coming out of this chicken! 